Extra 10 tech points. Nice. Unbelievable! How could Yamato fall into Zimarsa and Nexus's hands? Maybe it defeated. Maybe it defeated with Boson Jump tactics. I believe the sentence you're looking for is maybe it was defeated with Boson Jump tactics. That was certainly a factor. But there's a reason Yamato wasn't able to resist. What reason? Commander Okita collapsed. Huh? I heard you've been in bad shape since the battle at Glee at Gleesy. Glee I think the teleportation affected him as well. Just the Marsons' successor surrounded us. He found himself in <clears throat> wrong voice. I haven't been voice I haven't had a chance to voice you for almost a month. I think the, I think the teleportation affected him as well. Just as the Marsons' successor surrounded us, he found himself in need of emergency surgery. Grasping the severity of the situation, Exo Sonata decided to follow the Martian successor's instructions and stop resisting. But they're planning to use terror to overthrow society! Calm down, Tobia. We've never been fans of guys who urge us to cooperate at gunpoint. But Yamato suffered considerable damage through the teleportation. The commander's surgery and Yamato's repairs, we just needed more time. But didn't the Martian successors see... Didn't the Marsden successors seize Yamato in the hope of making it a part of their fighting own fighting force? The Exo assumed that would be the case, so he had a meeting with the ex engineering officer and exaggerated the severity of the damage. This is the other reason why you want to multiply your repair estimates by a factor of four. If you can fix the repairs before then, it makes you seem like a miracle worker. And also gives you an opportunity to stall if you're being blackmailed by some evil organization, or how they gunpoint by some evil organization. And also, if they then insist on you doing it sooner, then you can actually... They're, they're, they'll dial it down to, say, a fourth of what you offer, which means is the actual time it will take to repair the job, as opposed to if you give an accurate estimate, they'll expect you to do it in a inaccurate, in a time that where it cannot be reasonably completed. That man really knows how to keep his cool. He threatened to obliterate nearby facilities if bothered, but that threat prevented them from coming closer. He also said we'd cooperate after completing repairs. That not only prevented them from meddling, it also caused them to confine it as if it, as if it were diseased. The commander has since recovered. The commander has since recovered and returned to active duty. I see. So that's why you began a counterattack. But is everything really okay? Doesn't Command Lieutenant Kodai's absence put Yamato at a disadvantage? Not a problem. We took action to retake Yamato, had insurgents at key posts. But we had to flee after the plan failed. Ryoma to the rescue with a dose of reality. You may make fun of me, Tobia, but it's, a, but it's me of all people who's entrusted with a message from Bernadette. Ah, I'm not sure how I feel about that. With all the trouble in Amaratsu, we figured the Earth Federation would come, but we never expected you guys. We have had our own share of difficulties. But we can't stop now. The Mars successors know we're close. With Yamato, they'll probably move his HQ from Amaratsu. He'll probably assemble nearby nearby forces. If we're not careful, we could end up against everything the Mars successors got. So what do we do? We might need to use our we might need to use our secret weapon. We're preparing our own cat plan to capture Amaratsu. Plan? Plan? Yes, I've added this group for that very purpose. Sis, I've been waiting for you, Nine. You wanted to talk? Let's make up. Huh? I'm sorry, Nine. I'm sure you're the best inten only best intentions with the whole Tetsuya thing. And yet, I failed to consider your feelings. That's not true. If anything, I didn't consider consider yours my feelings I tried to tell you like I can tell you like Tetsuya from how you tried to defend him huh and the fact that Tetsuya risked his life to save you means the feeling is mutual what 
lucky you. Um, uh, nine? Are, are you suggesting that you dislike Tetsuya? No, I wouldn't say that. Hmm. I like him, just not in the romantic sense that you seem to be suggesting. I've heard men and women can't be friends. And where did you hear that? Well, where do you think, sis? I'm going to go with... Sa First guess, Saburuda. Second guess, Lieutenant... Second guess, Lieutenant Kurtz. So he is not my friend. We're comrades. Comrades? We risk our lives in battle together, and that's why I believe in Tetsuya and can count on him to save me. I'm a little jealous, because I'll never be your comrade, sis. What are you talking about? You're like a sister to me. A sister? Like I said, you're more than AI to me. But then again, I'm not much of an older sister for you. Always helping me more than I help you. I wouldn't say that. You're pretty incredible, sis. You never cease to amaze me. But today is no exception, and I know... I now know what comrade means. I'm very happy to hear that. Let's do our best, Nine. We've got to get Yamato back. And then what? Well, think of that when the time comes. Our first order of business is to stop the Marcy successor's threat to world peace. Agreed, sis. When we take Yamato, it doesn't mean we'll be able to get home. We might be too late even if we do. And yet, we have to press on. Nine and I have to give it our all. actually want for these I do want to go with the higher people first so they get 50 and get um ace the attack points directly everyone leveled up and a whole bunch of cash Not even close enough attack points yet. Efficiency, rationality, feelings, life. Are they contradictory or not? These are the things that... Okay. Chapter 20 for the next batch. So, after the next mission, we will unlock the next series of... Um, so DLC missions. That's what you say. Alright, um... 
Okay, and skill. Actually, let's teach that to, um... Maito, because he's in a super robot. Super robots are slow. Let's boost the movement of some super robots. To unlock another slot on that. Um. What do I equip that with? That with the. Uh, That's a thought. Let's save. One more mission today, and we'll give, then we'll call it an episode, a session. This should be when we retake the Nundisco, or try to. Banjo, why don't you understand how Dawn feels? Because I hate you all and my Meganoid creating father. You and Don Zauser, leaguer of the Meganoids, so sure that you're better than human beings, and most of all, that ego. I hate it all. The Meganoids possess the power human beings need to spread across the galaxy. 
But Power alone won't survive, Spandro Heron. We need you and Daitar in three. Me and Daitan? With Don Hauser's help, your powers can change the world. I refuse. If, I refuse. If I were to change the world, it'll be because I wanted to change it. Oh, I'll need to make sure to, to do some deployment of, Zeit, of Daitan 3. Banjo, it's time to wake up. Huh, I never thought I'd be caught napping. Are you okay? You didn't look so good earlier. I had a strange dream about things I thought I'd left behind a long time ago. It must have been quite a nightmare. You were tossing in your sleep. It was. We'll be beating the plan to capture the Amaratsu. Would you like some coffee before we, before we go? Yeah, I appreciate that. Make it especially strong and hot. This next plan must not fail. After all, it'll be my life on the line. Still, I don't plan on dying. Not until I've taken out every last Meganoid. I have to solve Don Zauser's mint riddle. What does power to change the world mean? It seems relatively self-explanatory, but... I could be wrong. Well, hello there, Mr. Tokugawa. How are the repairs to the wave motion? Just as I reported, we need more time. Yamazaki, I've been sending you daily reports on this. Now, now, Sonata, as a scientist, I'm sure you can understand my desire to study unknown technology. That much I can understand. But if that's the case, why don't you explain the mechanism behind the bosun jump in more detail? Someday I will, if you are sincerely willing to cooperate with us, that is. Are you saying you don't trust us? If that's the case, why don't we just start up this half-repaired wave motion and generate new... But if we do, I doubt this will be the only colony caught in the blast. Boss! You've got to control your temper! You should listen to Yabu. I have no desire to see that happen. Still, the boss doesn't like to be kept waiting, so you see, time is of the essence. I understand. Of course you do. After all, who knows how long the officers of the other ship will stand for this. So, spare me any further escape attempts. If you could just cooperate with us, you'll be rewarded for your efforts. So you all can use Yamato for your terrorist plots. Boss! B boss, that's enough! I won't deny that. This is all for the sake of the new order. But the power of Yamato is certainly impressive. I'm, I'm more interested in the alien technology within. That's the reason why I volunteered to oversee the repairs. If that's the case... I'm sorry, wrong character. If that's the case, why not test it by bosun jumping to a parallel universe? Excellent, Sonata. It's amazing to figure out so much about bosun jumping from what little I've explained. In any case, there's still much we don't understand about it either. Our ability to use it to its full potential is all thanks to him. Him? Enough talk. Enough talk only can't keep you from your work any longer. On my way, I look forward to seeing the repairs completed soon. He's golden. You think he saw through our lies? Probably. But he's more of a scientist than a soldier. He's afraid they'll use Yamato if he forces our hand. It's a race against time. Eventually, they'll take Yamato from us. Earthlings from other Earths killing each other. This is exactly what Commander Okito was afraid of. We're counting on you, Kodai and Mori. Yamato and Earth's fate rests on you. This is basically 10 Forward Lounge. I meet here of all places. This is the last place anyone would suspect. I see, it's the perfect place for a secret meeting. Indeed. Well, how's the crew holding up? It's been a month since we were captured. It's really starting to take its toll on them. The time was perfect. Their knowledge about how our Earth meant they could easily convince us how promising this Earth could be. And they were already worried about their mission, and this was a massive blow to morale. What are you trying to say? Is it okay for Earth to be the objective of the Azumo plan? I overheard talk that Bosun Jumps might have the power to leap between dimensions. All conclusions must have fast facts behind them. We don't have any proof. Perhaps, but something we consider after we take control of the Bosun Jump system. Commander Okita won't agree. Using force is always his last resort. It's up to us. The alarm! Tactical officers return. As suspected, they haven't deployed yet. He sure picked a bad time to come back. Let's continue this later. I suppose we don't have a choice. 
Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. And also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks, also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that.